What's up guys, this is Brother Shield here. Um, today is going to be a very quick video on The Walking Dead, the final season. Basically, I'm going to focus on um, The Walking Dead story builder. So, because it's the final season of The Walking Dead, all my previous... Um, yeah, I've already done this before, by the way. Yeah, I, my choices were made um, Clem loyal. But yeah, I'm going to start over and uh, basically talk about uh, the stories and basically the choices I made throughout um, season one to season three so without further ado let's begin uh, let me just allow that okay so yep now let's talk about my choices it's a bit laggy though when the dead started walking i was small and alone okay until a man named lee became my protector I don't know what's going on there. Lee protected other people too, but he couldn't save everyone. All right. I chose to save Carly. You can never save everyone. The living were just as dangerous as the dead. A woman in our group named Lily lost her dad. And then she just couldn't cope. She took the life that Lee saved. Uh, I chose to leave her behind. Lee left her on the side of the road. Lee taught me how to survive. He protected me as long as he could, but he got bit because of me. And even in the end, he was still teaching. All right, um, this one, this one, uh, kind of randomly chose, but I think I went always keep moving. And always keep moving as much as you can. Move. Lee wouldn't make it. He knew it was the end. He made one final request. Yeah, <laughs> I actually chopped off my arm and uh, basically uh, said no to shooting. And I did. I met another group after that, broken people, running from their past. There was a woman who gave birth to a boy named Alvin Jr. AJ, he made it. But the mom didn't. Uh, I don't know why it's lagging and so much. And I started to take care of him. But then, Jane left AJ in the snow. We thought he was gone forever. That was the last straw for Kenny. And without Lee around, I had to make the call. Uh, I chose to let Jane die. That was one. That was one hell of a choice. I couldn't. And Kenny killed Jane. It turned out AJ was alive. Jane hid him to make a point. Knowing what they'd done. Yeah, this this choice is where things get a bit tricky. I chose to stay with Kenny, but then I chose to stay at Wellerton, but um, for my third choice. So, um, yeah, here's where things get a bit dicey. Uh, hold on. I still decided we were better together. For AJ's sake. But like everything else, it wouldn't last. AJ and I traveled to a new frontier. I thought we'd found something that worked. But I was wrong again. They took AJ from me. Said I was too young to take care of him. Uh, this one um, was quite tricky. Um, I fought for AJ. I let him be taken. It depends on the ending I, I get, really. Back. But I wasn't strong enough. I searched for a long time. Just when I gave up hope, I found him. We're searching together now for a place we can call home. I'm all AJ has. He's all I have. And I'll protect him with my life. 
just like Lee did for me. Okay. So the only issue I had here is that um I did not get the um choice between staying at Wellington or staying with Kenny because um originally in my first walkthrough of season two I chose to stay with Kenny but um but in season three Kenny ends up dying so I end up I ended up going back into season two and choosing to stay in Wellington and le letting Kenny go because I really wanted Kenny to live man because he's just my guy so yeah that that was the that's the issue that I had here with the choice builder. So um well my main my main concern was Kenny because I chose to um you know uh go to Wellington, stay in Wellington and the, another issue I had with the mobile version, especially the Nvidia Shield well the Android version is that they removed the scene of who dies um during during um season three. Uh, I'm sure many of you guys know if you played season three, there's a clip of wh whoever you stay with that person dies. I'm not sure if they removed it, but uh, yeah, when I chose to stay with Kenny, it was Kenny that ended up dying. So instead, I chose to stay in Wellington. So um, you know, because I don't really care about those people. So okay, so uh, yeah, that was the issue I was having with this um story builder because I basically rewrote my story to make sure Kenny lives. So season three, my choices didn't really matter. I was playing through, but I did replay through because um, I ended up choosing uh. Javier's brother, um, David, as well as Gabe, and over, uh, I think it was Kate. Yeah, that that was it, Kate. Um, in the end, uh, I could have um, cause um, the, again in season three, it depends on the choices you make that Clem will follow. Who will follow in the end? He can either choose to go and save Gabe, or he can choose to go and save Kate, or you know, basically the choices. Normally, I would have preferred Clem to go after Gabe, so at least I would have had the option to choose between Kate and choose Gabe, but. Um, Clem instead my choices made Clem loyal to Javier and um, yeah so I, I ended up choosing David and well my brother and <laughs> and uh, his little boy so yeah that was um, the choices I made however the issue is as I've mentioned earlier in the video season 3 I'm sorry the final season of The Walking Dead is not going to come out to Android and, uh, and, also, and also a quick caveat uh, this is going to be Telltale's last um, time using the game engine, the Telltale 2, I've been told. Um, the Telltale 2 is basically the, the engine that they used to make the Telltale games. And as many of you guys know, um, it's pretty buggy. Um, any any time that this game has had bugs, is really because of that engine. And now they're going to move into Unity, I've heard, which I think is actually a better choice. Because um, that game engine is much more developed compared to um, the Telltale 2. And yeah, the Stranger Things, um, Telltale is also coming out as well as season two of The Wolf Among Us. So this is going to be the final season of The Walking Dead. I'm going to play this on the Xbox One X. So since I can't play this on Android, this is going to be completely focused on Xbox. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much the choices. I just hoped um, all my choices ended up um, coming through. Um, you know, I just hope my choices just ends up going through. So anyways guys, that's pretty much the end of the video. This was going to be a quick short one and this is just a quick update on um, my choices I've made from season 1 all the way to season 3. So season 4 is going to come out this Tuesday. I am going to stream it uh, at the 14th I think. Uh, it should come out and it should say here. Anyway, I've already pre-ordered the final season so yeah hopefully all my saves and all my choices are still there i've um tried i've synced my i've managed my account i've synced my account to all my telltale choices so this is going to be like the final run for the walking dead and uh i was hoping if i get to see rick or you know negan hopefully but that's never gonna happen but anyways guys let me know what you think um of my choices in the comments below and if you guys um also had your own choices um uh, please share also in the comments below and as always guys you know what it is i'll see you on the next video have a good one